Thank you for calling Progent. This call will be recorded for quality assurance. Good morning, Progent. Or good afternoon, Progent. Can I help you? Yeah, I was wondering what your services are all about. Um, I came across something saying that it has like a email guard for inbound and outbound, outbound spam filtering data leakage protection and email encryption um i have some guy that is hacking into my um information to program um certain internet search results as suspicious messages um he uh abuses the internet system through gmail by uh uh, IP network abusing through um, trying to send uh, phishing, uh, spoofing, and fraudulent and forged emails. And this guy's uh, tragic Cadmus. Um, he has some kind of hacking ability to make some kind of technology interference through my personal information. Uh, this guy is an online threat uh, through. Um, uh, threatening me through sextortion scams, sexual exploitation. Um, this guy is criminal. He tracked down my personal information after I um, broke it off with him in 2016 through Facebook. And after I broke it off with him, he tracked down my personal information and using is and is using my personal information against me through identity theft. Um, I got many notifications that my information is being circulated through the deep web. And um, I get a Norton, Norton Security LifeLock by him um, trying to use my personal information to set up personal accounts. Like I said, this guy um, is a, a very, very dangerous online predator stalking women um, through, ex through extreme um, stalking for over six years now. And this guy uh, is using his hacking abilities to... Um, to um, sexually abuse me through internet, sexual cruelty through email, um, IP network abuse, um, abusing the Gmail system, abusing uh, Facebook platform. Um, I, like I said, this guy is a very, very criminal intent. Uh, he's a very, very bad person, and I want to see how I could uh, track him down by uh, identifying his IP address where he's sending these fraudulent emails by uh, harassing me every single day for the past six years, all day, every day, and this guy uses his um, his internet threats to to intimidate me, taunt me, provoke me. Like I said, this guy is a very very serious mental case. He's a psychopath, and I don't know what to do, what how to um, track this guy down to see if you guys can investigate him somehow. So, like, this is a desperate cry for help because um, I'm being sexually abused and sexually exploited by this guy online. And that's the only thing he knows is his internet hacking. Okay. That's it. So, like I said, it's a very severe mental uh, crisis I'm going through that this guy will not stop bothering me through the internet. Well, you know, for our services, we do a variety of different things, but they, um, they're about $175 an hour. Um, we typically deal with businesses. So, um, you know, I'm not sure if you have a, a local, I, you know, where are you located, by the way? I'm in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Yeah, okay. So, I don't know if we have anybody there. So, but, I don't um, know what to do. Do, do I contact you that has, um, like, um, IT skills through internet forensics to see if we could somehow stop this guy from abusing the internet system? Do you know... Um, do you know uh, so yeah, I'm. I'm going to transfer you to one of our um, uh, and one of our consultants and let him talk to you real quick, if you don't mind. Okay. Are you there? Okay, hold yeah. on. Serious start to tell you. Um, uh, hey, yeah. So, so bear with me one second. So, I, I was able to overhear some of your conversation. So, let me just ask you a quick question. Can I get your name first? My name is Terry Luna. Is that T E R R I I or Y? L yes, T E R R I. Okay. And Luna, like the moon. Yes. Okay, uh, and Terry. So I understand you think your. It sounds like you think your PC and your network has been compromised, and that someone is. Um, I don't know if they're. They're they're espionage. Media. 
platform. And, and uh, eavesdropping on my phone calls. They're using my my camera to stalk on me uh, through uh, sex sextortion uh, threats. This guy is off the wall. He okay, uses okay. the yeah. Okay, so so um, so you know you I, you can report to some degree these things to federal agencies, and I don't know whether anybody will take action or not. But there are tools that maybe you could put in place to. Um, prevent and detect anybody who's hacking into your system. Um, we do have security professionals who can do more forensic analysis, but it can be very expensive. Um, so, you know, you're better off probably looking at how can I protect myself? How can I, you know, protect my network? What can I do to ensure um, that people aren't able to gain access to my personal information, files, computers, etc.? Um, but the forensic aspect is is very expensive, you know, to because it takes a lot of time to come through and look through and monitor and and do other things of that nature. So, so if I um, have like over you know, thirty. So 35,000 emails saved from this guy. You guys can't do uh, like the email analyze headers to track down where the where these uh, where the IP address is originating from, where these emails are coming from. Well, frequently there's spoofed information, and so uh, I'm not a forensic specialist myself, but we may be able to, to go from that. And so, you know, what we could potentially do, I mean, we, I can take your information and uh, maybe give you an, or an email address that you could maybe, you know, describe what, in, what, uh, what it is you'd like to have done in terms of your emails uh, analyze to you know determine see if we can identify you know if if he's spoofing through um, you know fake IP addresses or things of that nature I don't know exactly how it's done I know it can be done then you know I don't know if it can always be determined but I can I can ask a few questions on your behalf um, but you know and then you know once again though in engaging one of those consultants to help you you're probably looking at at least one to two hours of time, and you're probably looking at, um, you know, 175 to 190 an hour. Okay, so maybe around $300, $350, $400 for the service for two hours? Correct. Okay, that might, that I'm, might be I'm not trying to square. I'm not trying to square. I'm not trying to scare you off. Um, yeah, I know. And, and I'm not sure what all we can accomplish, but... Um, I've got your number here, 347-871-2331. Um, Actually, and, that is a Google uh, Voice a phone number. That's a Google, that's a Google okay. Voice phone number. It counts that this guy is, uh, you know, using as a abuse uh, system. So, okay. yeah, I have, uh, so I have two different email accounts that I want to see if I can get this accomplished by. Um, but the main one. And, and what would you prefer that I send you? The T. Okay, T. Okay, it's T Luna T L U N A six five seven eight at gmail dot com. And also, too, I was reading up on your services that you also do um, email migration. That maybe you can transfer all of these emails to a different email so that way I could just save for backup and try to close down these emails that he's abusing? Um, yeah, that's a, certainly something we could uh, assist you with. Okay. Good, I'm sorry. In other words, you were talking about taking these two email addresses or accounts that you have problems with and moving all those messages to... A, a third email address? Is that what I mean? Yeah, answered? yeah. Uh, email migration. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, nice. Um, yeah, there's a number of things that could be potentially done there, depending on whether you just need to collect that for, say, forensic review or some, you know, uh, pursuing that, you know, something against the individual, or you need to have access to it to review them and look at them and, and things of that nature. But, okay, um, it sounds yeah, like. So, yeah. Sounds like we can. So let me. Um, I'm gonna just send you an introductory email, um, and and then I'm gonna need to kind of reach out and talk to one, or it may take a couple of consultants to kind of identify the right individual to help you with these aspects and kind of get a, get an idea as to what we might, you know, how we might approach it and things of that nature. 
Um, is it only um, so in terms of um, of the abuse, if you will, or, or um, you know what you're trying to stop? Is it just uh, email correspondence? Or no, it's other he's Facebook uh, or no, social media. Fa yeah, social media. He abuses Facebook, the that platform. Because when um, I met him, his name is Mika Jala from Finland. He's overseas. I met him in Facebook in 2016, and I broke it off in 2016. So he did not like the idea that I broke up with him, and so he desperately tracked down my personal information. And like I said, he's uh, using my personal information okay. to threaten me. And um, yeah, this guy, he abuses Facebook, Gmail, um, IP network uh, domain abuse. Uh, what else? Um, harassment. Um, just, I like I said, this guy's just, like he uses the internet to make internet threats to stalk women online and uh, commit uh, psychopathic tendencies and to okay. um, use uh, sex as a weapon and abuse women online through stalking, extreme stalking, and like I said, it's through camera, it's through social media, it's through the internet, it's through my internet search results, my information, all that stuff. Okay. So yeah, this guy okay. is a, this um, guy is well, a so I'm criminal. I'm email, and if you can kind of um, outline that in a brief reply. Yes, I'll make a statement. Know, yes, um, I will, sir. Yeah, yeah, and, and and I'm not looking for so much a statement as just so much more of a description of the areas that you're being compromised. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so that I can address um, each of those needs or kind of talk to about those needs with our consultants to see who's the best fit and what the recommendations are. Okay. So I've got T L U N A six five seven eight at gmail dot com. I'll go ahead and send you an email and then. Um, you know, uh, I can walk you through or talk to you about how you can create a ticket or create an account with our company after I found and kind of identified and okay. we kind of figure out what the what the initial cost would be or whatever. Okay, okay, so it seems like it would be going in phases, like phase one, phase two, all that stuff. But yeah, I'll get everything detailed and I'll, I'll send uh, my info or my statement or what uh, services I yeah, need from you guys. Just kind of an overview. Don't. Don't don't need yeah just kind of an outline of the services and yeah. and where you where you'd like to see us help you so okay uh, give me um, a, a short while to to compose the email I'm just finishing an email for someone else right now so as soon as I finish that I'll I'll type something out for you Terry and then uh, take it from there um, okay sir um just in case my uh, the email doesn't go through to tluna6578 at gmail.com. I would like to give you my other email address uh, uh, just in case you can't get through because, like, I have some settings yeah, on. Let, let's do two things. Let me give you my email address. It's my first name, Mark, M-A-R-K, Okay. Uh, dot, my last name. Okay. And then I, I'll take your the other email address for you as well. Okay. So the other email is evil moon eye. It's E V I L M O O N E Y E at gmail.com. Those are the two email accounts I need to report. But yeah, that's my second email. Okay, very good. Okay, thank you, Mark. And mine is, yeah, and so my email will be M A R K dot M U E L L E R at progen.